dagger here is a medieval fantasy combat sport. It's, um, the real definition is very, you know, convoluted because people just look at it and think it's just LARPing, you know, with the whole lightning bolt, lightning bolt, and, you know, dressing up and stuff. Part of that is true, but um, uh, a lot of it is just a lot of um, athletic combat um, going around and running and throwing and hitting, and it's a full-paced combat sport. Some of the rules entail uh, uh, the safety of the game. Uh, for one, there's no headshots. Um, if you lose an arm, if you get hit in the arm, then you, you lose the arm and you put it behind your back. And if you lose a leg, you have to go on your knee to uh, simulate you lost a leg. If you lose two limbs in any combination, then you're dead. And also, if you get hit in the torso, you are also dead immediately. All weapons can go into a few categories, and the categories are separated in color. You have blue, red, green, yellow, and white. Now I'll start with the first. Blue is, is basically um, a one-handed weapon. So that can be a simple sword, it can be a mace, a club, a morning star, a flail. Just as long as it's swung with one weapon, it's counted as blue. And all of these categories have certain like weight and dimensions, dimension restrictions, but I don't need to go into that. Um, red weapons are two-handed weapons, and uh, they have the advantage of obviously being bigger, so you have longer reach, and they can also destroy shields with two good hits. Then you have green, which are stabbing. So a blue and a red weapon can also have a green stabbing tip on it. And also there are spears that count as green because you can only stab with them. And you also um, and you also have daggers, which are pretty much just little pieces of foam on a stick that you can stab people with. You have yellow, which are thrown projectiles such as arrows and javelins. And then you also have white, which is a very strange category because the only thing in that category are rocks, which are basically all the spare foam you have when making weapons, duct tape together, and then you just throw it at people's heads. It was, let me see, really early in middle school, and you know, being a nerd, I also had my nerd friends, and they said, hey, why don't you come over one day and play this new game we started called Dagger Here, that we found, called Dagger Here, and I said, Okay, so I went to their house and I just see a bunch of people running around with pieces of pipe and foam duct tape to them and I probably had the most fun I've had in quite a long time since then. This is a real life video game in this, I mean in a simple sense, it's, this is what people think when you're playing like like a combat game, like, I don't know, Shadows, Shadows of Mordor or something, they say, it'd be really cool if I could just go out and actually kill orcs, or, you know, fight elves or whatever, or be an orc, and that, that's what it is. It's a real life video game. Just last week, a last session, we had someone who never played the game, who was brought in by one of my members, and was very hesitant on playing because, you know, it's, you know, you're hitting people with foam swords, but by the end of the day, they had to admit it was fun. And so, that's a win for me. It's become more part of my life than I'd expect it to, because I walk around with dag weapons in my hand around Catholic campus. I have people stopping me and asking me, when is dad, or how come I don't see you guys outside anymore, or like, um, I just, I'm just that dad guy to people, because they say, hey, you're that dad guy, right? Yes, I am. I'm the guy who plays dagger here. Now, I don't, I, I don't honestly think they're head, they have a negative connotation to it but it's just kind of shaped the way people have seen me. For me, 
DACA here is a place I can go to get my exercise, um, can talk to people I don't usually talk to because just of, just of how Siena is, the theater department is a little a ways away from everywhere else. So I get to talk to people I don't talk to often, I meet new people, I can teach people something that I really enjoy, and then I can spread that to, to other people and have them enjoy it as well. It gives me a creative output that I rarely get to use. Um, and it's, it's honestly something I've wanted to do my whole life. I just didn't know what the name of it was. Try it. If you have any interest at all in any part of Dagger here, whether that be dressing up or pretending to be a knight from a faraway land or even like an orc, or you just want to go out and beat your friends, this is what you have to try because nine times out of 10, they're going to say, no, this is one of what I was looking for. But that one out of 10th person is going to say, I will be doing this for the rest of my life. I'm Patrick Wallace, and I play Dagger here.